As you're likely aware, we marketers are kind of obsessed with data, and there's a good reason why. Data is the key to unlocking insights from our marketing campaigns, and those insights allow us to do better things, such as increasing ROI. Yet although we know data is important, it's really become harder to harness, as the channels that we're gathering it from have increased exponentially. We send emails, deliver ads, build websites and apps, and that's really only scratching the surface when it comes to communicating with our customers. The challenge with this is that all of these communications or touch points speak in different data languages. There is overlap, of course, but the need to translate differing data sets to one universal language is critical so that anyone in our organization can understand what happened in real time and leverage that knowledge to enhance all of our customer experiences, regardless of our functional role or department. So how do we become by data lingual and improve everything we do? Well, these three easy steps are a great starting point. So our first step is to focus on translation. As wisdom tells us, communication is key to a long lasting relationship, but communication isn't just about speaking. It's also very much about listening. For marketers, the same is true. The only way for us to improve on the customer experience is to listen to what's working and what isn't. And the only way to do this is through data. Yet with every channel providing different data sets, that might as well be different languages, and the manual work that's required to unify all of these data points, we struggle to interpret that information quickly enough to learn from and adapt to. One way to look at this is to imagine a friend of yours who would speak to you in English and in Spanish, but didn't realize you only understood Spanish. In this scenario, you wouldn't be able to interpret everything they said, and therefore you'd not be able to respond or react appropriately. To do so, you'd need to translate, but translating takes time. You're trying to download and interpret and then connect that to what you did understand. By the time you've done this, your friend is gone and well, you've missed a chance to do anything. The same goes for leveraging marketing analytics and data to enhance your campaigns. You need to do this quickly and accurately. And when left to manual devices, it's just not fast enough. That's where technology comes in. It can help you unify and standardize all of these different data sets, turning them into real-time insights that we can use to act upon across messaging, audiences, insights, and campaigns. Okay, now it's time for step two. We're now using technology to translate all of that campaign data from all of our channels. It's time to put it to work and make our campaigns even better. But where do you start? Data is powerful, but it can also be quite overwhelming. So how do we identify where to begin? Well, luckily for us, the technology solutions that allow us to ingest and translate all that data also use AI or artificial intelligence and machine learning to identify abnormalities. This could be things like specific campaigns spending too much, engagement decreasing across a campaign compared to that of your average KPIs, or an overall drop in year-over-year -year revenue. With AI, marketers can quickly uncover hidden opportunities across all of their campaigns and channels, meaning instead of digging through numbers, they can actually focus on driving campaign effectiveness and campaign performance. It allows marketers to kind of have a digital assistant who can analyze information quicker than any individual can. And you know what they say, with many hands, well, you get it. Okay, now that you've solved the too much data issue and the translation issue, you and your fellow marketers are all set, but you need to solve for one last silo issue, and that's your internal departmental silos. Now, marketing is typically the part of the business most focused on the customer, but it's not the only department that can benefit from consumer insights and campaign performance. Your C-suite, for example, your sales, your finance, and product teams can also benefit from this data. However, they tend not to be able to understand the information coming through, which means your marketing teams are always having to explain it and deliver it to them. This usually occurs on an ad hoc basis and can be extremely time consuming. Fortunately, a powerful analytics technology, kind of like the one we mentioned earlier, caters specifically to this, translation of information. 
So using the previous language example, let's say your sales team speaks Spanish and the C-suite speaks Hungarian and your product teams, I don't know, they speak JavaScript. Well, as marketers, we can leverage the technology to identify the language and data that these individuals need and can interpret, and then set up an automated insight and information directly to them in a way that they can consume it. Automation here is key, and it allows your teams to create something only once, which means instead of pulling reports for other stakeholders whenever they ask, they can focus on testing and optimizing performance and evolving their marketing campaigns for success. So that's all we have for you today. To learn more, head on over to Trailhead and check out this amazing new mix.